Oh, sorry if I just brushed your ass with my hand. Or am I? Hey everybody, I'm Megan. And I'm Caitlin, and we are here on the Hollywood Walk of Fame wondering why do you guys make relationships so incredibly frustrating? All right, Eric, you're gonna help us vent a little bit and help us figure out why guys make relationships so frustrating sometimes. For example, why do you guys possess the innate ability to say the exact wrong thing at exactly the wrong time? I honestly blame girls for all that. I'm not really sure. Maybe uh, indecisiveness? I try to go around and say things that I don't mean it sometimes. So you start talking and it's like, it just comes out and you're just like, ah, I didn't mean to say that. It's like they want this one specific answer, but there's a million other things I could say. So you think we have the script written in our head and we just haven't showed you, but we want you to know it. That's kind of what it feels like. Why do guys text one word answers in reply to a long text from a girl? I guess when you're with your boys, you get caught up in the, like, in the conversation. Why are you texting us in the first place? It's a phone call do. Oh, okay. So you you think the complicated questions should be reserved for a little uh, little phone call action? Absolutely. And I ask my boys sometimes, like, this should be fine, right? And they're like, oh, it's cool, don't worry about it. Oh, so guys are like perpetuating this amongst themselves, like, oh, it's okay. fine. It's gonna be okay, don't Go worry. Go ahead, she'll it's be cool, cool yeah. with the one word that's, response. That's, that's, that's... Men are more simple than women, you know? They're just, yeah, okay. So we see thorough and detail-oriented, and you say too long and too complicated. I didn't understand that one. <laughs> Point made. Why do guys always say relax or chill whenever we're upset? That seems like probably the, it'd be the best course of action. Seeing her upset kind of makes me upset as well. So I want to calm her down first and then try to think about the solution afterwards. So it's coming from a thoughtful place. Yeah, life is too short to be stressed or to be like to bother about anything. So just chill. So you're not trying to just shut us up? Oh, no, never. What makes lying so much easier to tell your girlfriend? Well, you think of the five-second lie or the 20-minute discussion. Ah, it's a matter of efficiency. I'm a straight like... shooter, so... Straight shooter. Straight shooter. That's what we like. Sometimes it's rude, though. Well, listen, we'd rather hear the <laughs> truth. You may think that they're going to forget it. Mm -mm, trust me. It will come back and hunt you down. Day knows. Day knows. Why do guys lie about the dumbest things? You say you're going to the grocery store, but you're really going over to play video games with your friends. It's just easier to lie. Did you hear that, ladies? Screw the truth. Okay, Jay, we're gonna do a quick word association. So you say the first word that comes to your mind when you hear that word. Ready? Okay. Here we go. First date. Great conversation. That's all right. Dinner and a movie. Favorite. Traditional. Making plans ahead of time. I don't do it. Not my thing. Boobs. Big. <laughs> Love boobs. Dad. <laughs> so, Caitlin, what did we learn today about why guys make relationships so frustrating? Well, Megan, I think we don't need to take that kind of behavior personally because sometimes guys are just being lazy. Don't you think? And hey, they're not all bad. Ladies, if your guy deserves an award for romantic lead, Tell us in the comments. Subscribe to the Glamour channel.